lawns, gardens, and fields could get a little bit of a soaking tonight. Chief Forecaster John Milan joins us now. We do need the rain, John. We certainly did uh, get a lot of rain at the beginning of the summer, but now the rain has diminished through July and August. As you see, uh, we were down in July. We were down so far this month. Uh, we need a lot more rain than we've gotten, and especially to, to our south where Racine and Kenosha has missed a lot of the rainfalls over the past few weeks. Doppler radar, let's stop, start with that and show you uh, that we're looking essentially at showers moving out of Sheboygan and Ozaki County. Here's a line of thunderstorms starting to push into Dodge County. They're in Columbia County, down into Dane County, and all the way south into Rock County. Thunderstorms from southern Jefferson County starting to push into Walworth County. These are moving slowly to the east. Some heavy downpours with these storms, and you can see on Viper radar how slowly they're moving along from west to east at about 20 miles per hour. Showers moving also very slowly. The showers way out to the north. Those are actually moving from north to south. We have an upper low pressure system right on top of a satellite picture. We'll put that in motion and what you'll see is this is the development of the showers and storms in the late part of the afternoon. Behind it, there's a lot of clearing. So we're going to see uh, the skies clearing out during the morning hours tomorrow. 78 your high today, 80 in Sheboygan, 80 in Green Bay and Wausau, 81 in Madison. A very seasonal day. Our temperatures right now, 74 degrees in Milwaukee, 72 Waukesha, 70 in West Bend, where it's raining, it's cooler, where the sun is shining. It's a little bit warmer. It was a beautiful day today if you did get into some of the sunshine. Tonight's lows drop to 61 in Milwaukee, 58 in Waukesha, 57 in Watertown. Pick out your town. Uh, most of the rain will be over by about midnight tonight, so no more showers after that. Even though the computer models try to keep the rain right through tomorrow, we might have an isolated shower in the morning hours, but high pressure then rolls in and dries things out and stays. Uh, we stay pretty dry right through the rest of the week. The winds go northerly tomorrow to the north-northwest, 72 in Milwaukee, 71 Green Bay. We drop to 74. In Madison, Rhine layers some sunshine and only 68 there. So showers with isolated thunderstorms could see another quarter of an inch, maybe even a half inch under some of those thunderstorms. North winds and 60 degrees for tomorrow. A slight chance of a morning shower, but clearing cooler. That's the real weather word for Tuesday, 72 degrees. Tomorrow night, clear, cool, 52 inland, 57 in the city. Wednesday, beautiful day with temperatures in the upper 70s and lots of sunshine. Here's your Storm Team 4 10-day outlook Thursday and Friday. Lots of sunshine, mid-70s, so we get that pleasant air once again. And the weekend's starting to look pretty good at this moment. Maybe a stray shower or thunderstorm. Temperatures near 80, and we start out next week in the 80s. So if you get under one of those thunderstorms, you could get a pretty heavy downpour. And people need the rain, so. We could use it, so be forewarned. Rainy days and Mondays okay. never get me down. Very because good. it's on Mondays yes. <laughs> instead of the weekends. Thanks, Sing John. <laughs>